We're going to do a little thrifting tonight on the way home. We're in Youngstown, Ohio. We're going to pop in here. It's getting close to closing time, but I think we still got time. Yeah. You always get time to thrift, right? We can Listen, we're professionals. We can loop around this building in no time <laughs> flat. The cashiers are probably like, oh, no, we got browsers More coming in last going. minute. Oh, no, we are. We're on it. Look at this right here, $14.99. I'm telling you, put a little bit of paint on that. Oh, that would be the most gorgeous buffet. This chair, how old do you think this chair is? That chair is 20s. It caught my attention too. I just love that style. All right, so we're going to head over here and first things first, boom. Wedgewood Jasperware right off the bat, still in the box. Friends, this channel is powered by Junk Monkey Paint, which is our very own brand of paint that we, me and Matt, created together to flip our thrift store finds for resale. Great for all kinds of projects that just need some extra love. Grab a brush, go bananas. We have been seeing this style. We've done a little research onto it, and we found out what? It was made 1700s, uh, I think it started? It started in the 1700s and has been made continually ever since by Wedgwood Company. So you can tell that Wedgwood is authentic by some of the knockoffs have the word E after Wedgwood, but there was actually no E on it if it's the real deal. Right. Um, also, some of the imitations of Wedgwood don't have it like, you know how it has that raised? Yeah. Okay, so if it's not raised, it's not real Wedgwood. And if you ever see it with a glaze onto it, like a shiny glaze. Not Wedgwood. No, it's what biscuit. it's called. Yeah, <laughs> you're just talking about biscuits. Yes. Yeah, but I'm mad. Oh, I love this sign right here. Let snow. Yes, biscuits are my favorite subject next to <laughs> snow. So uh, actually, I think we're getting some snow tonight. What's it like where you guys are watching from? So I threw that into my basket as well. But yeah, two finds right off the bat. I like it. All right, so you never know what's in a box. Recently, we found a beautiful, um, what do you call it, fairy lamp still yeah. in the box. Yeah. So I had to, you know, pull that out just to see what it was. <laughs> Nothing I wanted, but we left it there for the next person. So we're here cruising here. That was just a little light cover. Yep. And this is, we're in kind of the quasi-holiday seasonal department there. And you is found this a tissue this. box? No. You know what this is? This what is, is a it? giant planter. This is obviously some flowers. People sent flowers to somebody, and that was the big flower box. Pretty right. cool, though. Nice and, you know, gold that's, and that's shiny. That's the first time I've seen a ceramic version of a Amish doll. Really? Yeah. I, maybe now that you think about it. Yeah. Now that I think about it, I think you're right. I'm guessing this is a ring dish. Yeah. I, okay. Is that why that is there? <laughs> you know, you hang your... I don't know. I wanted to call it something else, but it's a, we're a family-friendly show. <laughs> I mean, that's style bowl. So I guess that's what you, it is. Did you see that piece of milk glass? That no. wasn't milk glass. That was actually a crock pot. Was it? You plug it in, it heats up. Yeah. It was I never knew pot. that. Here's this little dish here, but it was flashed. You can yeah. see all the... And we learned about flashing on. as uh, where, you know... Basically, it's a cheap way to produce glass that looks expensive, but it's just got a outer film onto it that scratches off super easy. I am preoccupied with this watermelon you, bowl. For some <laughs> reason, you're all about the fruit right now. Not what, the grapes, but the what, watermelon? What's yes. What's the deal? Yo. I don't know. This is the second one I found. So apparently painting half watermelons must have been a thing at some point. Right. Love this fish here. I almost took this fish plate home. Why didn't you? I thought you were going to. Well, trust me, I was eyeballing him up. Do you see that little part on his fin there? Yeah, but you would have never sold it to anybody. You would have just I would have kept it. it. You're probably right. I know right. how you are. It says it's made, made in Italy. Italy, right? But yeah, so I, I, I just love collecting things with fish on it or anything coastal. Mm -hmm. So it was hard to leave. Somebody will take you, little fishy. That's not a little fish. That's, that's a big a, fish. It is a big fishy. Yeah. I don't recognize this name up here, Crooksville. Anybody watching? I don't know. It? But somebody got rid of their Amish doll collection. Yeah, they did. A little wooden piece of garland there. I had no idea what this was for. It looks like a giant chess piece. I don't know what it is. A lid, perhaps, to something. Probably. Ooh, there's a little. Was it ceramic? Single candle holder. No, it was wooden. Oh, okay. Uh, More watermelon. <laughs> Watermelons are fun to paint. This was a ceramic plate, which was cute. If it didn't have all the chips into it, I might have grabbed it because I think it was that cool. Was some, it was fun. You left somebody's watermelon collection there. Watermelon and Amish dolls collections. So this plate here, you know what? Now that I'm watching that back, that those plates almost look like there could be something special about them. I did find some cool um, Italian-made plates coming up in just a second. Is that a... No, it's not a perfume bottle. The no, white piece. It had a cork in it. I have no idea. That's a Goofus-inspired dish there. Probably. And that's and you know what? 
that's, There's more that's, watermelon. We found two goofus inspired dishes there tonight. And, oh, actually, over one step over here, um, I get to the plates. I did decide to pick up. These were collectible plates. Right. Wayne County Fair. Yep. So. These right here. So they looked cool. They looked hand painted. Right. And they looked kind of special. And I was feeling them just to feel if I could feel the raised edge. And it had that weave yep. look out around the basket look. They were obviously hung on somebody's wall because they still came in the... No holder. Yeah. So I looked it up. I'll flash a picture on the screen here. I found this when I was standing there. And I'm like, I better grab these because oh, they're being sold for like $18 a piece. And I have two. So why not, right? One of those toothbrush holders there you were focusing in on. I was like, oh, you're, no. You're like drawn. You're like drawn like a moth to the frame. I cannot stand toothbrush holders. Like, that's my pet peeve. One of my pet peeves. I'm thrifting. I don't know. They just find me. Mm. Okay, so i got to ask you guys. What's like the thing that makes you go, <laughs> that just makes you cringe? When and, you find it. Yeah, when you find it at a thrift store. Like, what is the thing that you cannot handle that you're just like, makes me want to run away? This candle holes didn't make me want to run away. It just needed to be some dry brush with some paint to look a little dimensional. That would have been a cool piece. That was a cool uh, jar there. But looked old, too. Unfortunately, it was broken off. Yeah, it's because it had all those raised, you know, yeah. The flower was raised, and so it's amazing that when you think how old a lot of this glassware, you know, how the collectible survived. that we're finding, yeah, yeah, and all the kids out there who broke stuff over the years, <laughs> that's right, touch mom's stuff, you right. know, yep, it's sitting on, and now when I'm older, and I think about it, it's on a mantle, it's away from everything. You should never break it, you should never even come close to it. That was what's nice wrong sign. with you people. Are you saying, Matt, that you broke your mom's stuff? I, I didn't. No, I don't know. Seen, I'm hearing a little like you know what goes ooh, down in the living room with football. Like a what a McCoy or something like that. Like an old was, yeah, um, but picture. Was, yeah, but it was no, there was no markings. And it looked a little new. I like this. This was a print, like a what would you call it? Um, Giggly print. I guess that's what it would be. Mm. Yeah, for your wall. It wasn't an actual painting, but man, did I love that horse. I debated coming back and taking it because you that's like somebody that who would love whimsical what. You liked that horse because it was sassy. It was. She had flair. It was a sassy horse. And color, and she was happy. So anyway, I thought that was a cool print. What about you guys who are watching? Yeah. Somebody will come and grab it. That's the thing about a thrift store, you know. As many people who walk through there, they will find a thing that's meant for them. Like right, right here, somebody who collects hot rods. Yeah. <laughs> that reminds me of the vehicle that, is it the Monsters? Yeah, the Dragula. Yeah. We might need one to go with this house, a car like that. We'll yeah. pull it in the driveway. Oh, that's all our neighbors that need now. Our poor neighbors, they live with a lot. Yeah. We just, yeah. <laughs> they think we're vampires. Yeah. Stay up all night. <laughs> night owls. Oh, I thought someone was watching They're not me entirely there. wrong. <laughs> I told you we eat lots of garlic. No vampires yeah. around here. Nope. That's a cute little um, gingerbread type house. Yeah, it had a few little chips on it. Gosh darn it! I just wish sometimes that you know you find the pieces. That was cool. And they were in perfect shape. It was a the pumpkin? pumpkin bowl. Yeah, there's a lot of fall stuff on here today. Fall and Christmas. Hey, Santa's taking a bath here. Isn't wow. that funny? How you look at him like from that? Wow. Doesn't yeah, it look like he's like in the like tub? A, yeah. So. I've seen so many different Santa designs. Um, this season, out picking, it's amazing. That was kind of cool. Anybody out there collect Santas? Because there's many, many, many. Too many. That was a nice little dish. That's what I was saying. That was a nice little relish tray there. I had to check to see if that was a uh, ceramic right. flower plate in the back, but it was not. Okay, I had no clue what this was. Wondered if it was something special. Does anybody recognize it real quick? I don't think it went with that plate. There's the other Goofus inspired plate that we found. This is a yep. new one. But it's done in the Goofus style. So the Goofus style, we've learned, it was the premium carnival glass that they would give you, right? The premium gift that they would give you at a carnival. And uh, it was poorly made. And what would happen is the paint would... Chip um, off of it. Yeah. The paint would fail. And as a result, they called it Goofus glass. Right. And so I think it was made, if I remember, like late 1800s, early 1920s, yep. like right in that time frame. So when you find Goofus glass, you're definitely going to know it because it's going to be scratched up. Before stuffed animals. It was. <laughs> you got glass. A Goofus. Nothing nothing dangerous about that in the amusement park with 
hundreds of people bumping into yeah. each other. Yeah, I wonder where they came up with that idea. Let's give some glass. Yeah, so, so yeah, so when you go on your I, next carnival ride, you can take it with you. I like that little gourd pour picture thing. It was kind of cool. Did Different. you? Different. Yeah. Oh, there. Did you just see the one that was over next to this one too? Yeah. You know me. I like the odd and the strange. Right there. Look at that one. Oh yeah. Is it? Well, That's cool. It's a pumpkin, but it was done a newer in the piece, shape but... of a bell pepper. <laughs> that's, why, that's why I kind of was like... Hey, I, no I, rules I, with creativity. I know, but you know me. I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm right-brained on some of that stuff, right? That was so nice. Yeah. Did you see that? Yeah. Wine glasses. Wine glasses galore at any thrift store. Right. But you know me. I'm a wine glass snob, so they got to be exceptional. Mm, me just giving me some glitter on them. Ooh, look at that. That's pretty... Oh, I'll yeah, pretend that thing. I'll pretend you never said that. And I'll pretend <laughs> like I never heard it. Okay? I like the, the fun glasses. It doesn't have to be the expensive glasses, just the fun glasses. You know, oh, get away from me, toothbrush holder. <sighs> oh, it's like you, now I'm just focused on them. Let's focus on these glasses. What is that? Oh, it's 12 days of Christmas. Those are pretty. Only it's the fourth and ninth day. Love this. Style the rest of them were spent on a vendor. So there you go. There's a purse. Do you remember the time we were at an auction and I bought an entire luggage set? I did. Nobody wanted it. And it was an entire luggage set for all of, I don't know, maybe $10. I mean, the whole set. And I remember, nobody would take it. Nobody would take it. And I'm, looking and I'm like dying going, I don't have anywhere to go. But you know what? I put my card up in the air and he's like, sold to the lady. And then he said to you out loud over the speaker, if she wants to go somewhere, now you've got to take her somewhere because she's got the luggage yeah. set. <laughs> and I never took you anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Yeah, it drove me crazy. Yeah, right? that's about it. Oh, too but funny. you didn't need to pack for that. That was free of charge. Nice. Yeah, you uh, have to leave Good home. times. So anyway, I did buy a, a complete luggage set one time oh, at an auction. So orange mom, hey, Florida. shout out to Florida. Florida. If you are from Florida and see in the comments, soon. do say hello. Yes, we, Ooh, we shall see you yeah, soon. This dresser could use some love. Yep. And I had to take a look at this because it is a cookie jar. Yes, it is a cookie jar. It's beautiful. It's colorful. That's a neat little cookie jar. And it's got an entire bunch of flowers on the top of it. I think that's pretty cool. That is 